Um, I wish I'd known to ask more questions. As a freshman, I wish I would have known to not be afraid to ask questions. Teachers are not there to hide things from you. They really want to help you. And so if you don't know something, just ask. People are really here to help you succeed and they want you to be successful. The first thing is I would say be true to yourself. You want to make sure that you're following your moral compass and what you're doing as you enter the world of technology. The second thing is as you're preparing for school, I would always say to study hard, but play harder. This is going to be a time in your life that you'll have a chance to meet people from all over the world. You'll have a chance to take classes outside of your major. So if you're studying hard, that's going to give you an opportunity to also have a good full campus uh, social life. The third thing is it's important to mentor and network so early on if you have the opportunity to identify either upperclassmen or graduate students or even faculty that can help you to guide you through your career and help you to make the decisions. And then the final thing, one of the things that was successful for me personally and we also do here at CHOP is I would encourage all students to take on an internship or co-op uh, during their studies and I know that's something that's required at Drexel. It just provides you the basis that you need uh, to understand the working world, to learn how technology actually uh, works out in industry, but also helps you to establish those connections so you potentially have um, a job or references upon graduation. So those are the things that I would tell the students coming in this year. As a student athlete, my focus was solely on school and sport. That's just what you're exposed to. One of the things I wish I had known when I was a freshman was about the many groups and organizations for women in tech specifically uh, at Drexel and within the College of Computing and Informatics. As soon as I finished my last season of basketball, uh, I went out and found um, different groups and organizations that I was interested in and I joined them. It was, it was through one of these um, organizations within the College of Computing and Informatics uh, that I received a scholarship to attend the Grace Hopper Conference, um, which focuses on women in computing and women in tech and allowed me the opportunity to network and interview with companies like Google and Microsoft. Uh, through my experience there at that conference, um, I ultimately landed a job with a Microsoft and Accenture company called Avanade uh, prior, a year prior to me even graduating from Drexel. Um, in sharing this story with you, uh, I hope to encourage you all to go out and find the organizations that are right for you. Figure out what it is that works for you because like me, you never know what great opportunities you might stumble upon. Um, one of my biggest advice is that take advantage of all the resources you have around you. Definitely join the Women in Computing Society. I've made a lot of new friends that way. And another thing is to definitely explore uh, hackathons and coding competition in Philly. They have so many great companies there and you can network. And finally is to like never be afraid to ask questions because like teachers are there to help you and you'll make a really good connection with your professors too. What? do I wish I knew when I was a freshman? Wow, there's so much. Uh, the one thing I would say is when you're learning in university and doing your co-ops, find the areas that really get your passion and get your interest. If you're in a major or in an area that is not something that you're passionate about, switch it. Because the work is a long, lifelong journey and it's easier and better when you have passion and you love it. I didn't come in to my collegiate career like in a technical background. Um, I went through college, I got a degree in psychology, and I've been in the workforce for a little while, and now being a woman in a computing you know, degree, I think the best advice I could offer anybody at any level is just ask for help when you need it. There's always other people out there that might need the same help, um, people that could benefit from your help, but you, know, you just can't be afraid to, to admit when you need some extra support. Um, I wish somebody had told me not to get discouraged your freshman year, um, knowing that there's a lot of different skill levels that come in to freshman year like some people come in have been programming since they were kids and you have people like me who came in knowing Microsoft Word and surfing the internet and that was the uh, extent of my technical skills so freshman year was uh, definitely the hardest year for me but if you use the office hours and the tutoring center um, use those resources I mean they're there for you and 
you're technically paying for them through your tuition, so might as well use them. Um, and once you get through that freshman year, you have the skill set you need to uh, pursue a technical background. So definitely stick with it. <laughs>